yeah, I think it's a more of a social issue. I see more posts on social media about this kind of thing recently. Yeah, it's become a very social issue and this has become an harassment to them really. This is still okay because I don't really hear this uh, quite often. It's still manageable, I think. I think abuse of anybody is a social issue, not just taxi drivers. Because I feel that it's unfair to them also because they are doing the job. I think it should, should be considered as a crime. It's seriously like, you know, hurting another person, either emotionally or mentally. I think it is because a lot of people take advantage of taxi drivers and they feel that they're very easy to be bullied. I mean, there's always two sides to the stories. Some passengers can be unreasonable. That's just ridiculous. That's not all. You don't order your food and, and eat it and say, I, 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 can't, I can't pay you because I have no money. It's not right morally or in any way. So that's, uh, for me, that's a no. The punishment should obviously yeah, be based on the severity of the issue. Where it crosses the line and it does impact someone's livelihood and safety, then I think there should be some form of punishment. To go to a certain extent to like jail, I think no. Lah. Fining, yes. Those who abuse uh, each other, they should be fined or better to be sentenced. I think they should make a law that protects the taxi driver, just like those uh, bus driver that we cannot assault them. Punishments wise, maybe just warning. I think to start with, maybe just warning, followed by like, fine or something. Maybe uh, warnings first, if it happens again, yeah, definitely punishment. Maybe a fine or something stricter, something that really puts it in the head of people that you shouldn't treat people this way. All taxi drivers should have should install the camera inside their cars. Install some uh, CCTV inside the camera. I think by installing cameras is good. I think that is the best way to go because you know you can't fault what's on tape. That's proof. It's your word against his word, blah, blah, blah. But if it's on video, if it's being recorded, then I think that's uh, very straightforward. That needs to be a deterrent. I mean, the punishment needs to be harsh enough. I mean, like any crime, because if it's just a slap on the wrist, it doesn't really matter. Definitely to educate the public, which the government should focus more on doing. Taxi drivers should go for some kind of courses like a majority like customer service. That's where they can able to learn all this kind of stuff to be very good, able to learn from the passengers. I mean that they can be good to the passengers as well. Our well, like radio station also broadcast more about it also. Maybe having an app that can sync the identities of the driver, the information like, of the driver and the passenger even if it's a flag down cap to prevent these kind of things happening. I mean, it is common sense to not treat a person badly, but there needs to be more awareness of like basic rights that these taxi drivers deserve.